Howdy y'all, it's Marina Ray, and today I'm hitting you guys with an original book tag. So my husband and I were sitting around and brainstorming for some unique and original ideas in regards to my booktube channel. We were talking about something completely different and he pitched an idea that set off this like train of thoughts in my head and I was like, wait a minute, not that wouldn't necessarily work for this video, but I could create an original tag off of that. So I can't take all the credit for this as my husband was a lot of the brain. He's smiling at me right now and making me feel weird. <laughs> I would have never thought to create something like this had he not said something that sparked my imagination and got my brain to going. So this tag was created by yours truly with the help of her husband. And it is called the Create a Town Tag. I did search around on BookTube before I filmed this or like did any of the research for the tag because I didn't want to be copying somebody else's work. And I just was like, man, that's such a good idea. It had to have been already done before. I couldn't find any video that was anything similar to this. If you have done it, I'm sorry, I'm not copying you. This is all thought up in my own head with the help of my husband. So yeah, let's just get on into it. So this tag has 12 questions. This tag does require a little bit more thinking and it requires you to really use your imagination more than what your average tag requires. So dust off that book trivia in your mind and let's create a town. <music> Numero uno. <laughs> Number one. Pick a town name choosing five words from five different books on your bookshelf. So I'm going to use V from Nicholas Sparks' The Longest Ride, Island from Anne of the Island, Of from The Best of Me, Unending from Love's Unending Legacy, and then Oceans from the Light Between Oceans to make the town name The Island of Unending Oceans. I thought that was really cool, so we're living on an island. Number two is to create a family using book characters. For my parents, I want obviously the Weasleys. They are the best parents ever. Even though they're dirt poor, they make the best out of life. I would rather be poor and happy than rich and miserable. So definitely the Weasleys as my parents. Keeping it Harry Potter related, I would also like Hermione as a sister. I love Hermione's character. She is so unique and so intelligent and just a blast to be around. So I definitely want to have her as my sister, but does that make her and Ron brother and sister? Let's let's not do that. Ron's not Ron doesn't exist in this universe. He doesn't live in this town, so we're not making anything weird. Number 3 is pick a universe to use as your town's setting. And you guys know me, I'm a huge fan of the Grishaverse, so I had to pick the Grishaverse pick a town mayor and I pick Dumbledore from Harry Potter. He makes a great like overseer of the school. I personally love Dumbledore. He's one of my favorite characters in the Harry Potter series. So I choose Dumbledore to be my mayor. Pick a town sheriff and I choose Clark Davis from the Love Comes Softly series. He is a no nonsense type of person so I think he would make the perfect sheriff and he would keep all the town rebels in line. Pick a high school principal and I choose Simon from the Siren Trilogy. Simon is in college but I can just see his future self being a principal. He's very into the academic scene. He's very smart. He's, he's very intelligent. He's very well educated and I can just see him being a future principal of the school. We'll have to wait a little bit for him to grow up but it'll also take time to build the city so I pick Simon for my principal. Choose someone to run your local bar and I choose Lucian from A Court of Thorns and Roses. Lucian is such a fun character. He's already woman crazy so add a couple beers to that and he would probably be the life of the party. So for my bartender slash bar owner I pick Lucian. Choose a town doctor and I choose Darla from the Ashfall Trilogy. She proves in this book that her main focus is survival. And a lot of the things that she does in this book just makes me believe that she would make an awesome doctor with the right amount of schooling. Obviously not just straight out of a dystopian world like Ashfall is set in, but with the right schooling, I think that she would make the perfect doctor. 
choose a town rebel and for that I choose Hayden from the Escaped Paradise trilogy. Hayden is one of my favorite bookish characters for all time. He is not a thinker, he's a doer. He, he doesn't follow any rules, he makes his own rules. He's a definition of a rebel and he's obviously adorable. So every town needs an adorable rebel like Hayden. Pick a town villain and I choose Snape. You know, I, mm, 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 I can't say much, but I can't say much. But I would only want a villain as bad as Snape. I'll say that. I'll say that. I would only want a villain in my town as bad as Snape. Choose a town rising star, and I choose Lottie Person from Snot Girl. Every town needs a blogger. Lottie Snot Girl is our blogger. She's our rising star. Plus, hopefully in my town, there will be a lot of people with different colored hairs. Rainbow Town. Choose two bookish landmarks to be placed within your town. I choose the castle, the Alayan castle, the castle of Alea, Alea, Alea from the selection. I think it'd be beautiful to have it as like a landmark. Not really in use, but just maybe a part of the town's history. Ooh, is my island a portion of Alea that's been plot twist? I want I wanted to add a Court of Thorns and Roses in there. Well, just one more time because y'all know I love it. But I would like to use the wall that separates Prithian and the mortal land as privacy fences between my houses. Okay, I hope that you have fun doing this tag. If you want to do it, do it. I had a blast creating my own town out of the books that I've read. I just think that's a really neat approach to a tag. I do have a few people that I want to tag and I definitely want them to do this. I would absolutely love if Jules from Pages and Pens did this. Jules has read so much that she has such a huge selection to to work with and I would just love to see what kind of town she would create what kind of people would be within that town I would just love if she did that so I tag her I also tag Rachel Marie she also has a she has a really great imagination she's like a genius so I'd love to see the town that she created using these questions I would also like to tag my friend Kate from chapter Kate Kate is so unique I, I just know she would have such a unique town. I also want to tag Sarah from Novel Serendipity. I would really like to see her town as well. And then I would like to tag Josh from Beards and Books. I can only imagine the town he's going to create. I hope that you guys do it. If I didn't tag you and you want to do it, go ahead and do it. I have no problem with that. Just find a way to let me know you did it so I can check it out. And yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys later.